Hello everybody and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey or I have way too many wires on my desk and we look really cool. I hadn't this one kind of like has like a little scarf thingy on the back of it. I like that. And I think we've got our helmet hidden. These pants look awesome. We've got like three different colors go like the red and the green and the blue. I really like it. Alright. What are we doing? I have no idea. Oh yeah, we leveled up our spear here and paint this also I've started finally reading um, I don't know if I mentioned it last time but I started reading Herodotus's histories <laughs> so I actually recognize some of these names uh, okay yeah Wait, that's that spear. Uh, maybe I need to like wait to upgrade it. I don't know. I kind of want to go back actually and do some of these, honestly. But I guess I'll have to wait. I guess I'm not too over leveled for him. Or level 14. All right, we'll stay in Athens. What are we doing? Oh, that's right. Okay, I was like, what, what are we doing? Where? It, what does it say? I've got like a new quest somewhere. Oh, maybe it was the bright one. The mighty Argus. Yeah, I saw him. <laughs> okay, and I have these, which are me destroying Spartans, I guess. I don't know. Oh. I guess I might as well. I don't know. I just can't really see. I, I see Cassandra bearing no love for the Spartans, but not like going out and like killing them. But I don't know. I don't know about that one. Wow, some of these are pretty far above my level. We'll make it. It's just in this game it feels like it's a it's an exponential thing like even if you're one level under you're gonna get screwed over big time I should maybe mess around with the customization but I think once I find an armor set I actually really like I'll do that as it is it's kind of fun right now to see what there is you know <laughs> you have a higher chance of finding ancient tablets in ancient ruins. No way. The cultists of the Peloponnesian League fight for Sparta. They control the legendary warriors by using their faith against them? What? When did I figure that out? Well, it's not. Telling me about the different league. Oh, okay. Worshippers of the bloodline, heroes. Peloponnesian ones. I assume these other ones, somebody's controlling Athens. Hmm. Oh boy, here we are. 
Why does it do that? <gasps> Doggy! I know that they're looking at the statue and like talking to it, but it looked like for a second they were like talking to me. Okay. Now that we're here. Looks like we're closest now. Uh. All right, let's do the hard one first. But we gotta vote somebody out of town for some, even though I can't, because I'm not a white male. Oh, uh, I'm stuck. A white landowning male, specifically. Oh boy. I'm so excited. Look at that. It's Athens. Oh my. Yeah, that was an owl. I'm sure there were easier ways off the mountain. The painted Greek statue. Oh, what? How would I do that? Nobody's mad at me, right? I only kill people when they're mad at me. I'm gonna like run into like so many historical places, guaranteed. Oh, pretty. Is that like... Oh, I thought it was just a lion's head, but it's like a... a <laughs> it's a pelt. Oh, and a jaguar one, too. Neat. It has such a pretty shiny paint. It was really pretty. Is that him taking down the Minotaur? That one guy taking down the Minotaur? <laughs> These are painted! It's so weird to see painted Greek statues. It makes them look like, uh, like, like toys. Like, I feel like they lose a lot of their... ...majesty. But not really, but it's just, like, kinda weird. You must be the one Pericles sent. I am. He said there was an ostracism vote, but didn't tell me what I'm here to do. Of course he didn't. That's what I'm for. Okay. If someone is exiled, can they return? If they do, they'll be punished. That's kind of the definition of exile. What does someone have to do to be ostracized? Anyone seen as a threat to the city or the people is enough. And then it is up to the vote. Some have been ostracized for simply being more disliked than the person they're up against. Weird flex, but okay. What's my role in this? The votes have already been cast. We don't have long before they're counted. Take the Ostraka in this bag and exchange them with the ones currently under guard. You want me to rig the ostracism? Pericles does, and he has his reasons, I'm sure. Bring me the bag you took from the room and I'll take care of the rest. No one will see me go in or out. Stay here. Okay, this makes sense. What's in here? I was expecting a better fight. Move along. I could have taken on another three of them, too. There's a lot of people yelling. That's exactly what I thought ancient Athens would be like. <laughs> Eponym ep eponymous heroes. The legend of the statues of the legend of the eponymous heroes. This is kind of fun. This is more fun than I thought it would be. 
playing around in ancient Greece. It's funny too, because I had kind of the same thing about Egypt. I was like, yeah, Egypt's so cliche. So it's a very cliche archaeological thing to get involved in, at least to me. And so is Greece. Better stay hidden. And uh, so I was like, I'm not really. In what? No, I want to run along the wall. I was like, I'm not really interested. It's whatever. And then I started, you know, I'm like so far into Origins, and it's actually probably my favorite Assassin's Creed to date. And it's so awesome. All the Egyptian stuff. I'm like, man, I need to get some Egyptian books. Read them. And now I'm like reading Herodotus' histories because of this game. These games! And that's the point of Assassin's Creed. It's one of the points of Assassin's Creed to me anyway, is that it makes you interested enough in the history to learn about it yourself. Like it gives you little tidbits. It's like, it's like, mm, yeah, here's some history with some fantasy, some fantastical, you know, element type things. But like, it's stuff that you're like, oh man, is this really real? And you look it up yourself. And I've always liked that. What? I'm hidden. Stop there! What are you doing? I'm not hit. Why wasn't I? I'm crouching in the bushes. I can't actually see what's going on. What? Oh my gosh. I see her! I actually thought I was hidden. I wasn't paying attention. Plus, these guys are apparently too high level for me to kill in one shot. what the codex entries used to be good for was like learning more about the world She says, I promise, she says. Oh my gosh, I have to do the Ostraka in the house of the leader? Alright, well maybe I can just not have to murder everybody. This area will be well defended. Pretty sure I've got everything in the location itself. Whoa!
And you want to re reload my stuff? Yeah, they didn't want me to kill anybody. So I'm gonna do my best. Okay, I switched him just by doing that. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'll probably be picking up a lot of stuff that's too high level for me. Oh, yeah, okay, I won't destroy these, but I will loot them. Okay, the other one's down there. I always need more money. All right, the other one. Okay, okay. I feel like this might not be the safest place, but we're gonna do our best. Okay, that building. Can I enter that building from the top? Yes. Yes. Okay. So I will leave this building. Oh, out. Okay. I forgot for a second that I wasn't supposed to murder everybody. This one might be a bit weirder. Okay, if I drop down, that person's gonna see me. Can I get my bird to harass? No? Guard rotation. <gasps> okay. Uh, let's try. Control this camera sometimes when you're trying to get. Okay, wow, this is just. Putting something on the first floor is really mean. Oh boy. And now I've, like, locked myself in here. I do. <laughs> See me? There's nowhere to hide. <laughs> it's a 
okay though. That's okay if I like pull them away. Yeah. Oh my gosh. No, yes. Go in there. Go in that room. No, 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 no. I should let Pericles' contact know. Oh. Oh, yeah? This is fine. Getting out was gonna be a pain. Whew, that was hard. That that bottom room was was un cruel and unnecessary. Ooh, nice jump. And I stole their stuff. <laughs> tried to use sleep darts on on the one or but if I use sleep dart on the one it would have notified the other one so I was like oh crap like I don't know Cats yeah. from all over the Greek world you wouldn't think the city was besieged by an army of Spartans this oh this is like um is this this is like where you'd buy uh stuff to to sell, oh my gosh, a giant pig. Um, where you buy like sacrifices and goods and stuff to, to give at the temple, I think. I don't, I'm not quite sure what that branching path symbol means. If anybody wants to let me know what that means, I would appreciate it. I could look it up, but if you want to let me know, because I probably won't remember to look it up, feel free. It's done. Hmm. You work quickly. No! What are you going to do with them? Dump them in a well. Ah, it looks like the official has arrived. I apologize for the delay. There was evidence someone attempted to tamper with the votes. Yeah, I knew it. Don't worry. The Ostraka are all accounted for. The votes were counted, and Anaxagoras is to be ostracized. I knew that if Be I slow to fall into friendship, but once you do, Socrates, firm and constant, it will be more difficult for me now that Anaxagoras must leave Athens. We were quite close, although he and Pericles were much closer. It's strange, Pericles wasn't here today to defend him. I don't trust Pericles. Would Pericles normally defend someone? A good friend? Of course. Yet, Anaxagoras seems pleased with the result. This day has brought more questions oh. than answers. Maybe they, maybe Anaxagoras wanted to be ostracized or exiled for some reason. That's interesting. You said you were close. He was like a mentor to me. Many of my best thoughts came to fruition through our conversations. Wouldn't it be nice to just like live a life where all you have to do all day is like learn and like think about things? It's like my dream life. I just want to be a scholar. Oh, but you gotta have money to do that. <laughs> Who are you? Ask anyone and they'll tell you Socrates. But a name gives you nothing. Our actions determine who we are, and every action has its pleasures and its price. With that said, then, who do you claim to be? <gasps> My name is Cassandra. And still, I don't feel I know you. Perhaps I can find out who you are a different way. 
You want to know me? Knowledge is the one good in this world. Surely you agree? Uh... I'm a mercenary. I can't be paid in knowledge. Ah, then you are driven by the desire for wealth. To but live? Me is the one thing people need. Many believe they need more than they actually do. We're getting into a philosophical discussion! everything just to survive. You are clearly someone who would do whatever you feel is necessary. Perhaps for Drachmi, or maybe to further a personal goal. That describes a lot of people. I suppose I'm curious why you did it. How could I not be when you're the reason my friend is being forced to leave the only home he's ever known? <laughs> uh, I didn't promise not to tell anybody, I guess. I did what I was asked to do. And your needs are greater than those of the man you helped ostracize. Still, you raise a fine point. Who is more responsible? Anaxagoras for getting himself mixed up in this? Or you, for simply sealing his fate? Hmm. He's getting to know me by like, it's like a quiz. It's like a weird quiz. Um... I suppose in the end I'm the one responsible, but at the same time, because like a lot of times for the people who would be ostracized or set to the ostracism vote, it was, it was manipulated a lot by those in power. But I guess it's not really, res I'm not the one, I don't know. I don't know if I'm actually the one responsible or like you could make an argument that I was simply just a tool in the, the cog, a cog in the machine that wound to Anaxagoras being exiled. I mean, I'm responsible for a bit of it, but I don't, but I hate to like not say I, I I hate to be like, and it's not my fault, you know? Like I feel like I feel like Cassandra would own up to like her own actions. She's like, I did it. Like I did this thing, and that's what led to his exile. Yeah. Fine. I'm more responsible, but I did it because I have one concern, myself. Then I hope you also think about today, about Anaxagoras, about choice. Socrates, there you are. Here I am. You're late. They're all waiting for you. I wish to see Anaxagoras's fate, and so I have. Tell them I'm on my way. Well, it seemed our conversation is at its end. Although I hope it isn't the final one. What? We have. Why are you interested in me? I'm a mercenary. I wouldn't know. <laughs> Guess I, I wouldn't know. Bounty hunter? What? Is it because of all the things I stole? But nobody, nobody knows I stole them. I wonder if I'd have gotten out completely. Un I, that, see, that's why I actually reloaded. Is because I felt like maybe killing some. Oh no! There's a bounty hunter over there. I felt like killing somebody would would go poorly when it's just an ostracism vote. But, uh, I was trying to get out unseen, but it was so hard. And if I'd have sleep darted somebody, it would have, you know, they still would have known probably. And eh, it was rough. That was rough. Who are you? Do I know you? Oh boy, wait. Oh boy. Oh my. Can they like track me? So we met Socrates. I was wondering how long it would take until we ran into somebody like Ar Socrates or Aristotle, Plato. Hi. You're probably too high level for me. Let's be real here. Zona the Mad Mistress. Ah, uh, I can. Oops. What? No. Oh. I could maybe 
Take on the warlock. He began his ruthless career by working in a family business. Early in life, he was tasked with defending ships along the local trade routes of Melos. It paid well, but he came to learn that taking the ships down himself was far more lucrative. So he's a pirate. Ooh, nice. Takes more damage from poison. Good. He takes less damage from fire. Good, because I specked into the poison line. This one, she might be, oh my gosh, she might be harder to take. She's so cool! <laughs> when Zara chooses a target, it may have been for Drachme or Glory. It may have also been because they refused to pay tribute to her goat-headed guide, Pan. Whatever the reason, she never has stated to strike them down and allow her pet to feed on their corpse. Her pet? Who, what? She worships Pan? That's a dangerous game. She enters a rage state when close to death and takes less damage. <laughs> so she's somebody I'd have to hit with my bow, hopefully. That sounds fun. Man, I just hate that, like... It's like such good stuff, and I want to use it. Wow. Can't wear it. I guess I that like I want to wear the legendary stuff, right? But then it's like, just kidding, this one's got better armor and I'm like, I don't want to get my teeth kicked in. Okay, right, we have to get Fide. Fideus is actually mentioned, like, in the intro of, like, the... Somebody's, like, summarizing the history, so I haven't gotten super far yet. But Fideus was mentioned. I guess... I'll have to call it here. I feel like we only did one thing, but it took a while to get done. So, anyway. Thank you all for joining me. I really appreciate it. Hopefully we can, uh get some more stuff done and get in. I feel like we need to kind of follow this Athens quest line for a bit before going back out into the world. Um, cause I think, I don't know. I, I'm hoping that after this, it'll be like, I don't know. I feel, I, I was told to follow Herodotus. And so I'm following Herodotus like by a friend. So that's what I'm doing. I'm doing what Herodotus wants. Cause Herodotus has some like far reaching quest or something that I'm supposed to get eventually, I think. So, but anyway, running around Athens is, is no problem. It's pretty fun. So, thank you all again for joining me. Let me know uh, if you have any suggestions or anything. I'm always willing and open for those. And I will see you in the next one.